Hello and a very warm welcome. In today's video, we're talking Franco, Collie Dog, Collar Pinto. He has been absolutely superb in the first three races I've seen from him, and I've been impressed. We're on the phone today, laptop, trying to do an update. Maybe Bill watched my video yesterday and he's not happy that I'm not a tick box fan. But yeah, anyway, Frankie Dog Collar Pinto, he's been absolutely brilliant. I've been really impressed with him. Williams, uh, retaining Logan Sargent was a mistake. Uh, they paid the ultimate price. Uh, but yeah, Franco Colapinto has come in. He's looked comfortable. He's been on Albon's pace. And he's not got the upgraded car. So it's been impressive. Very impressive. Um, three races so far. He's not looked out of his depth. He's an upgrade on Logan Sargent. He's done more in three rounds than Logan did in however long he was here, 35. Um, really impressed, honestly. Um, yeah, I, I just give these drivers a nickname and I, for some reason he's called Collar Pinto, so I call him Collie Dog now. Don't ask me why. I give a driver a nickname and it's just one foot one. It stuck. Liam, the lesbian Lawson, it, it sticks like glue, I don't know. So, yeah, collie dog. Um, anyway, let's get into his results. Monza. So, his first race, Monza's quite an easy track to learn. We've seen in the past Nick De Vries score points there. Um, it was a solid debut by Collar Pinto, but nothing spectacular. He qualified 18th and finished 12th. It was a good debut, no crashes. Um, yeah, solid. He, he did go through the gravel, I think, at Lesmo 2. But yeah, nothing spectacular, but a decent start. Then we jump into Baku, and I did a video. Who is Franco Colapinto? Well, he stood up and showed us who he was with an impressive display at Baku. He qualified ninth and finished eighth. Um, people will say he got lucky there because of Perez and Sainz's crash. Maybe so, but... He was there to capitalise. Back is a tough circuit for your second race. Walls to bite, yeah. Um, yeah, just really extreme is Baku. Four points on the board. That is impressive. Colapinto, second race, four points on the board. And that is what Williams brought him in for. And then Singapore. Singapore's a massive challenge for Colapinto. The other drivers have been in the car for like... 17 rounds up until that point. It was a massive test for Collar Pinto. He was going to be in the car two hours. Um, yeah, just physically demanding. Adrenaline, you know, tiredness, concentration needs to be, again, walls to bite you at Singapore. Qualified 12th and just missed out on the points. 11th, gutting for Collar Pinto. But yeah. So far, he's been very impressive. Alex Albon has got the upgraded car. Collar Pinto does not. Collar Pinto is matching Albon. Worrying for Alex Albon. Um, yeah. Imagine what Collar Pinto can do when he gets the upgrades. I'm, I'm really excited to see him. At the minute, he's put his marker down. He's put his name in the F1 community. He's showing what he can do to team principals up and down the grid. The seats are filled, I believe. Judging by my sources, Lawson's going to be in at Racing Bulls and Bottas is going to stay. But Collar Pinto should be on the grid, I think, for 26. Let's see what happens. Is he going to stay in F2 for another year? If so, I, I will watch it with keen interest uh, because Collar Pinto, he's really impressed me. Um, he's a rookie. Uh, he's looked, just looks at home. Um, most people crumble. I mean, he's young, isn't he? Most people will crumble. The big limelight of Formula One. But what's he done? He's capitalised with both hands. Remember the name, Franco Colapinto. And he's delivered a performance that people up and down the paddock will remember. So, yeah. It's early days, three rounds in, but I've been very impressed. If he continues like this for the last six rounds of the season, there's no reason why this guy should not be on the grid. Another youngster proving that he's good enough. And I used to go mad about youngsters not get being given a chance. For me, 
There's my laptop. Oh, yeah, you're talking now, aren't you, Lappy? Oh, yeah. Yeah, fact, a lot of good you are. Um, yeah, um, trying to download Windows 11. My computer's not compatible for Windows 11. Yeah. Comment down below your thoughts on Collie Dog Collar Pinto. I think he's been superb. It's early days. Three races down. Six to go. I mean, imagine. Imagine if he starts beating Albon. That's going to be embarrassing for Alex Albon. There's no cutting or drying. That would be humiliation. He's a rookie. For me, he's done very well. Um, yeah, but let's see. Adios. Thanks for watching. Hopefully, I can get this laptop fixed because it's got all my images on and I need those images. Thanks for watching. Adios.